and I'm a year past my expiration date. 50-year-old Robert Townsend never expected to make it this far. In 2009, the New Yorker was diagnosed with an aggressive form of brain cancer called glioblastoma. I just had a few headaches. Nothing major. I mean, I had headaches before. For many patients with glioblastoma, survival is measured in months. So Robert underwent radical surgery to remove the tumor and started chemotherapy and radiation treatments. But by 2012, the cancer was wreaking havoc on his health again. You could see like his, his face was like swelling and, you know, like he has this little puffy thing that happens under his eyes and it had extended into his cheeks and the whole nine yards. Jack watched his once vibrant cousin fade away, drained from his treatments. Robert's oncologist referred him to Dr. Samuel Goldlust at Hackensack University Medical Center in New Jersey, who thought a new device called the Novo yeah. TTF-100A could help. It uses alternating electric fields um, with arrays that are placed directly on the scalp, which works to kill tumor cells in a, in a different way than surgery, obviously, and in a different way than chemotherapy or radiation. Within a month, Robert was able to stop all other treatments. By the time he had a second and third scan, his, his tumors started to shrink considerably. Um, and I think we're now at our fifth scan, and every one of the last two scans has shown a considerable improvement from the last. Patients are urged to wear the device for 75% of the day. Skin irritation on the scalp is a potential side effect. After seeing the dramatic change in Robert's quality of life, Jack says it's worth it. His mind is active again. His body's active again. There's, there's not this fight now to just get up out of bed in the morning. I can get back on track for the rest of my life. For more information, check out NovoCure.com. I'm Rick Leventhal, Fox News.